So let's do this manually. What's the first thing we're going to do? We're going to open up our home page. Okay. Open up our home page. And let me pull up UFT really quick. Awesome. Here's my test section. Great. So in here, I also want to record my steps. So next step after we go to our website is we want to click on member login and then click sign up free. Okay, so next step, and I apologize, I should have clicked my account. I don't want to register, I want to log in. Click my account. Enter username, password, and click login. And then we're done. Simple test. And here, of course, and validate that we are logged in. Okay? So let's go ahead and create our test. So let's see what kind of functions I have developed. Click Control Space and check it out, guys. This is one really awesome thing that I love that UFT did is now they made the IntelliSense much better. So now I can see all of the functions that are associated to this test. So let me, I know I have a function called open home page or something like that. I don't even need to remember the entire name. I can just look in this area. Oh, look, function open application. That looks about right, push space. Sorry, I should have done that push space and look, it shows me I need a browser process and a web link. That's perfect. So browser process. And then a web link. Okay. Cool. So that looks good. Let me close this and run. Awesome. Does it look like it worked, guys? Looks like it did, right? Went to qtpeedstorial.net.